guys, it's Tina. Welcome back to my channel and Happy New Year. I am so psyched to share my best flexi rod ever. Woohoo! So let's begin. My hair is freshly washed and conditioned and as you can see, I have already done most of it. I am spritzing my hair with water to get it re-dampened or rather re-wet and then I'm gonna add in my moisturizer and I'm using the Shea Moisture Curl and Style Milk and I'm gonna smooth this all through my hair. Then section up a small portion to start working with and then you're going to add your forming solution. I am using the Jane Carter's Wrap and Roll solution which is light and adds a lot of shine. I use about two pumps of the solution and then rake that through my hair. I then continue on to detangle using a white tooth comb and then fine detangle with a smaller tooth comb. Next, use your flexi rod to roll your hair. So I am starting by rolling from my roots and working my way down. As I wrap my hair, I move my fingers down to hold the rod and maintain the tension as I wrap for a smoother finish. Then I am gonna fold the flexi rod at the top and the bottom. So let's see that again. Add your foaming solution, detangle as you like, whether you're using finger detangling or you know, using a tool. Either way, you want it really smooth because that will help your end product look beautiful. So add in your um, wrapping solution, detangle, and then go ahead and wrap your flexi rod. Start at the root and make your way down, keeping that tension, and then you're just gonna you know, fold the ends at the top and the bottom, and that's it, you're done. Repeat this whole process until your whole hair is completely flexi rotted up and then you can either you know go to bed with this but just remember that it is not pleasant. It is very uncomfortable to sleep with flexi rod so you can decide to go to bed and air dry overnight but I am going to a friend's birthday party so I'm actually going to sit under my dryer. So I sat under my dryer for about an hour and a half under medium heat. The Jane Carter solution really helps with quick drying time and so after an hour and a half my hair was completely dry. I'm just going to go ahead and take out the flexi rods by simply unwrapping it in the opposite direction in which the curls were placed. Unwinding it like so actually helps to maintain that form of the curl and it gives you that spiral effect which is so pretty. I swear this is the first time that I have had amazing results with my flexi rod and I think it's really just the way I wrapped my hair. So with all the flexi rods out, I decided to go ahead and do my makeup and then come back and separate my curls. So the combination with the curl and style milk and the Jane Carter's wrap and roll solution were so perfect in that it gave me a lot of shine and I did not need to use any rolls at all to separate. Like my hair is so moisturized so I didn't use any oils you can definitely use some oils if you prefer and I just went ahead and separated and then went on with my pick for even more volume and to blend any harsh lines and that's it guys this is the first time I have been successful with a flexi rod set and I can tell that 2015 is gonna be a bomb year <laughs> So unfortunately by the end of the night my curls dropped because I was dancing so much but I think next time I will probably use a holding spray to help keep the curls longer. But if you enjoyed this video and want to see more definitely check out the links using African Thread for some awesome curls. I hope you enjoyed this video. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram is T1806. Don't forget to subscribe and of course guys stay beautiful. Bye!